such a beautiful morning good morning guys so it is scale it up friday so every friday is going to be my weigh-in day and this lighting is crazy <laughs> but and i'm calling it scale it up friday so i weigh this morning and my weight was 325.4 so this week which is my first week being back on keto i lost 7.6 pounds so it's not bad i'll take it definitely seven pounds lighter you can't beat that <laughs> so um i am about to, well i have to wait an hour because of my thyroid medication but then i'm gonna make me some breakfast um, I haven't had breakfast in a while. Um, I've been intermittent fasting, so I haven't had anything since probably about 1 o'clock yesterday. I'm just going to be making um, some bacon and some keto pancakes, which is just like cream cheese pancakes. And um, today I'm just going to be at home. I'm editing today and... Um, answering some emails and stuff like that so we're gonna see what we can get into today but before anything if you are a new subscriber thank you so much for subscribing to my channel and if you haven't subscribed yet you should go ahead click that subscribe button also if you want to add me on my social media like my snapchat instagram twitter definitely add me but before we get going, I'm just going to take some stuff out of the fridge. Let me show you. So for dinner, I have these um, these ribeye steaks shaved extra thin. So I'm going to set that out. And I figured I would have it with some rice veggies. Now this is Normandy blend. It's chopped cauliflower, broccoli, and carrots with a cheddar cheese sauce. Six carbs per serving. That's not bad. So I'm going to have that. But I am going to set out my cream cheese so it can start thawing out of it. Okay, guys. So it is about 8.30. So I'm just having my breakfast. This is some low carb pancakes. I will have the video linked up above and down below if you want to check it out. But this syrup is sugar free syrup and a serving is a fourth a cup. So that's why it looks like so much, but I probably could have done half a serving. And then I just have some bacon. So this is my breakfast. And I will have the macros right down here and in the description box. Okay guys, so it is about 1.40 and I was getting so hungry. So, um, this is just some shaved prime rib and, um, I just cut it really, really thin and cooked it up and then I made a keto cheese sauce to go, uh, with it. So this is going to be my lunch, but, um, again, I will have the macros right down here if you want to, if you're interested in that. So yeah, so this is my lunch and I will also post my total, um, calories and macros so far. One of my girlfriends invited me out for lunch slash dinner. So this is my dinner. I just have um, a bunless bacon cheeseburger with some pickles and some mayo on this side. So I am back from my lunch slash dinner with my friend. Um, as you saw, I just had a bunless burger. Um, I don't know the nutrition facts on it, so uh, my macros I'm just going to put for my food. I ate at home today, um, so I don't really know the macros for the burger and stuff, so it is what it is. Hopefully I didn't go over my calories, but knowing me, I probably did. Um, I'm pretty sure I didn't go over the carb limit, so... I don't know. We'll see in the morning. <laughs> but thank you for joining me on this little vlog today. I'm pretty sure it was really boring. Um, <laughs> but yeah, 
so I will see you next Friday so we can see the amount I lose next week. So hopefully it will be just as good, if not better, than this week. Because <laughs> I did have a couple of road bumps, you know. I took my friend out to eat. Um, then we had pizza the next day. So I kind of had to re-lose some of the weight I had lost. But I still did good. 7.6 pounds. So I will see you next Friday, guys. Bye.